Hey everybody, welcome to an unboxing video. I saw on the PlayStation blog that they had clear PlayStation 4 controllers and I thought, awesome, because when I was a kid, I had a green see-through PS2 controller and I loved it. And I just saw clear and I ordered it right away. I know Japan used to have the clear version. But it was more of a frosty white clear version. So these are retailer exclusive products. The one I ended up getting was the GameStop version and it's completely see-through. It's I'll show you in a second. I'm going to unbox it here, of course. That's what this video is for. But there's also a blue and a red that came out. Blue is for at Walmart and red is at Best Buy. So I didn't know that when I ordered. So I was like, eh, I kind of like the blue too. Which one do I want? But then the clear, cl the clear came in and I'm like, yeah, clearly, ha, huh, clearly, this is the one I want to keep. So without further ado, let's open this thing up. We have our standard PlayStation 4 box here. Controller box. I'm gonna open this thing up. It looks super nice inside the packaging. I just realized I'm opening plastic right next to my mic, which is probably not a pleasant experience for you. So here we go. We got that. That's on plastic. Right, it's probably just the controller. There is a little instruction booklet. I let it drop. I don't really care about it. I know how to use these things. I've been around the block a few times. Okay. I think this might be the one without the control, the bar on the top here. Hold on, let me plug this in for just a minute. This is what it looks like, and I'll power it on and we'll look at it. I cannot tell if there's uh, the light bar is shining through the top like the new models have. <sighs> Settling in. Okay. Here we are. It's on. I have my light bar dimmed on my settings on my PlayStation 4. If you didn't know, you can do that. So this is the right one. I got a little scared because this is actually more smooth than what I remember. I have my other one around here somewhere. But with the newer model PlayStation 4 controllers since the Pro came out, we have the smoother buttons. They're not shiny. They're a matte grayish color. They kind of look more like a PS1 controller style, like with the grays here. I wonder if that's picking up. I think it's pretty good, yeah. All right. But yeah, I really like the look of this thing. I think it looks really, really nice. And it has a nice, sturdy feel. Of course, the, this is one of the best controllers ever made, in my opinion. The DualShock 4. So I think... That's a success. That's it looks awesome, and I cannot wait to use this thing. This one's exclusive at GameStop. They got the blue at Walmart and the red at Best Buy. It'll be just like this, but colored. And I know the backing is is regular. It has a nice grip to it. Just like I feel like. I, let me go grab my other one real quick. It's right over here. So. Got a side-by-side -side comparison here. Very similar, same controller, just a new color scheme, which is exactly what I wanted. I love the, the feel of this, the build quality, and this one has a lot of wear to it. I've been using it a lot. So I'm excited to have a new one with a new color, and it's beautiful. Thank you for watching this really short and simple unboxing video for the Crystal PlayStation 4 DualShock controller. If you liked the video, go ahead and give it a rating. Leave me a comment below which color are you going to get? Because I love the clear. I, I'm a huge fan of this. And if you get one, let me know if you like it. Eh? Thank you for watching and catch you next video. See ya.